Hello. Hello. Hi, Arnulfo. Hello, teacher. So I sent you with Nelson and Juan Carlos Salas, but I guess they're not connected. So I will send you to another group. Enviaré a otro equipo, mejor. I will send you to another group. No problem. Yeah. Let, me, let me send you to another one. Let me see. Hold on a second. I'm having some problems here. I'm waiting, no problem. Uh, and Let me I. Go. Let me go to another group and so, then I will I will I will help so you. So not responding. Creímos que a nosotros nos decía. No me lo entiendo. Ay, ya que. Okay. El teléfono. El teléfono en vibrador. Yo no es it's on the floor. Eso es que se escribe, escupir, spits. Así se pronuncia, teacher, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Escupir. Spit, it's okay, spit. Oops. Spit, it's okay. Spit, ah, uh, alright. Spit on the floor, okay. Oops. Bye, chico. Gracias. Vamos. Bye. Sí, le está bien el Inter. Creo que es el Inter. Microphone teacher. Uh, hello, can you hear me? ¿Me escuchan? Can you hear me? Yeah. Yes. yes. I'm sorry, I am having problems with my internet connection in this moment. So basically my connection is not working right now, my Wi-Fi. And my cell phone uh, connection is really bad uh, too. Se le queda se escucha cortado, teacher. Se escucha okay. cortado, teacher. Okay. And now? <laughs> You look and now, like a robot. Yes, yeah. I, I imagine. <laughs> Galileo. <laughs> <laughs> and now, I'm do sorry. you hear me better? Y ahora? Estoy avisando. Y ahora? And now, much better? Or it doesn't improve, no mejora? No mejora? Se, se le corta. Congela, se congela la pantalla. Okay. So, Let, so. Ok, no se vayan a salir, déjenme salir y volver a entrar otra vez. Tal vez Ahora se le escucha bien. Ahora, Ahora sí. Right ah, tuvo yeah. miedo entonces, como dije que ya me iba a salir. <laughs> ok. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. Ok. So, um, so basically, uh, you practice the questions, right? Um, sorry, I am having some connection problems, ok? In case you don't listen to something, please tell me, ok? In case you don't listen to something, tell me, please, teacher. You have problems with the connection, okay? Please. All right. Now, in this moment, uh, we will go to breakout rooms again. The idea right now to go to breakout rooms is, um, okay, let me, share, let me share a screen with you. Okay. So look, hold on a second. Okay, here we are. 
Okay, listen, uh, on page number uh, 35, on page number 35, you have one reading. Good etiquette at the workplace. Tienen una lectura. Good etiquette at the workplace, okay? So the idea in this moment is that you read the article and you answer the questions, okay? Yeah? The idea is that you read the article about etiquette and you answer the four questions. Clear? Yeah, se escuchó? Can you hear? Could you hear me? Yeah. Okay. So for this, I will give you. Okay, listen. The idea in this moment is not to pronounce. The idea is not to pronounce. The idea is to read the article and answer the questions. Only that. Solo eso ahorita. Read the article and answer the questions. Okay. So we will work in groups of three. Vamos a trabajar en equipo de tres. We will work in groups of three for this. Okay. Let's go to work. Vamos a trabajar. Let's go to work. Ok. Teacher, me quedé solita. Hola, hola. Hola. Nunca, nunca hola, estará hola. sola. Nunca estará sola. <ríe> Igual que Tony Casaca, ¿verdad? <ríe> <ríe> es que el otro, el otro chico dice que no puede, dice. Ok, perdón. Perfecto, no hay problema. Ok, Jacqueline. Vamos a leer y vamos a contestar las preguntas, ¿verdad? Así es. ¿Qué le parece si leemos un párrafo cada uno? Qué veré. Me bajaron la del teléfono. Mira lo que están haciendo. Vaya. Este. Eso empieza. O como dice el dicho primero a las niñas. Yes. Vaya. Voy a tratar. <ríe> Dice, there are many workplace etiquettes. Y no sé cómo dice eso. Guidelines. 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 Okay. What is the mean? Guías. Sí, prácticamente son como guías. Bien. Okay. O lineamiento, yes. Dice, but at the most important is to be puntual to your office if you are late because you had an emergency that is to... however okay. habitual late commerce are in any organization if you get to your office on time you show that You are responsible and you respect the organi organization. If you know that you will be late, you know, got etiquette. ¿Cómo me dijo se decía eso? Etiquette. No, lo otro. Guideline. No. Guideline. Guideline will, will be, be called concerning audit auditor. Uh, authority, authority, authority. And report. So, why you are... you are late? Okay, yo creo que ese párrafo fue de la primera pregunta porque dice: If you know you are late, you should. Que tiene que llegar temprano, vea que si tiene una emergencia, pues, tiene que. Sí, o sea, usar. si alguien llega tarde, ¿qué es lo que debería de hacer? Va? Entonces, dice: compensa the time, call the person you report to. 
o no, ta, no do anything about it, o sea, no hacer nada, ¿verdad? Pero según el párrafo, aquí dice que if you get to your office on time, you should... All the person you report to, sería eso. Vamos a ver qué dice el párrafo. Yo, yo medio leí, aquí dice, to be called the concerned authority. Dice, if you know... Ya casi en la... Última. If you know that you will be late. Ajá. If you know... Good, it takes... Good, it takes ajá. With like will be to call the concert audit. Uh, ajá. And report the reason why you are late. Ajá. Up entonces... To the, the person you report to. Ajá. Sería... El, el, a B. Literal B. Ok. Vamos Ay, bien, teacher. Que... Vamos bien. Yes, yes, it's Se perfect. Fue. It's perfect. Okay, okay so the answer is perfect. <laughs> Apple okay. said, lea la, la, la otra. ¿Cómo eh, dice el párrafo en inglés, teacher? Say paragraph. Paragraph. Second, second, in this case, second paragraph. Exactly. Okay. It's Etiquette good. is also important when you have to communicate with your employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge. Knowledge, knowledge, ¿Qué knowledge. Eso? knowledge. 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 Knowledge yes. is uh, like a uh, conocimiento. To have good knowledge, like well, information, okay? Okay. okay. <laughs> of the workplace, email, etiquette, of other countries. In the official image, you need to, to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and grammatical perfect language for email. Okay, vamos a ver la segunda, the second question is... La, send the email in English. <laughs> no, la, la, little c express the subject ah, clearly. Dice, what is tip to apply in the official, official email? As in the email English, use a long salu salutation, express the subject clearly. Esa es. Eh, no sé cómo se dice esta palabra tan ra rara. No leche. Ah, ya entró el leche. No leche. Ay, sí, ahí está. No leche. En el tercer, en el tercer párrafo, teacher. Yes, no leche. ¿Cómo? No leche. No leche. No leche. No leche. No leche. Okay. In addition, no leche of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during or daily work. Be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisors. Listen to what they say careful, no, carefully and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpretation, interpretations. Okay. Será que está en esta la, la respuesta de la número tres? Yes. Sí, vea. Sí. La tres dice, which is not good etiquette when talking on the phone? Ahí está la respuesta. Is, uh, in the... Ah, por eso no quiere leer el game. Porque él está... <risa> él está buscando la respuesta cuando lee. <risa> ya le dio risa. <risa> Ay, ya la vieron.
la B, ¿eh? ¿verdad? Yes. Dice el letter B. Is. Um, yo no quinta. Sorry. Do, do not interrupt. Yes, that's the answer. Entonces sería literal, literal B, ¿verdad? Yes, teacher. La B. La B. And number two, what is a tip to apply in a short Which is not good etiquette when talking on the phone. Ah, uh, did you girls finish? Tiene apagado el, el micro. Continue working. Hola. No, no, y it's continuo. okay. It's okay. Continue working. Continue working. Okay. Thank you. Hi, Nelson. Hello. Is Omar Francisco working? Está trabajando Omar Francisco, no? Sí, está trabajando, teacher. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Okay, teacher. No, no, it's okay. Don't worry. Está trabajando, entonces estoy viendo cómo, cómo lo hago. Ah, okay. Okay. Pero es el párrafo grande, ¿verdad, teacher? Es que no le escuché muy bien en un momento porque también a mí me está fallando mucho el, el inter. Yes, the idea, the idea is to read the paragraph to, to the article. The idea is to read the information of the article and to answer the, the four questions. Y contestar las cuatro preguntas. To answer the four questions, ¿ok? Eh, pero las cuatro preguntas... Están Perdón, ahí abajo. Dice, creo que... Las que están abajo de, después del párrafo. These questions, estas preguntas que están al final del párrafo. Ok. Ya. Yeah. Ok. ¿Dónde está una que dice una? Literal A, literal B, literal C. Yes. Ok. Ok, dice. However, for, however, habitual late commerce are never appreciate in, appreciate in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible. You show that you are respons responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority and report the reason why you are late. But I'll let you... <clears throat> etiquette 
is also important then to help to communication with employees or clients in any ¿Cómo se pronuncia ahí, teacher? Teacher, any? tenemos una duda con unas palabras. Eh, las que pusimos las en rosado. Bueno, no, no lo escuchamos, teacher. Oh, can you hear me? ¿Me escuchan? Yes. 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 Where, Beatriz? ¿Dónde, Beatriz? Where? En las que están en rosado. Ah, knowledge... Okay, comp comprehension is the first, right? Comprehension, then knowledge, knowledge, avoid, and loudly. Knowledge. Loudly. Knowledge. Loudly era más que todo porque es como hablar fuerte, me imagino. Yes. Yeah, it's talk, talk loudly is hablar fuerte, okay. en voz alta. Talk loudly. Hablar en okay. voz alta. Okay, talk loudly. Mm. Okay, everyone. Um, well, I think it's time to check your answers for the question. Okay, who wants to share uh, number one? So you read the question and the answer. Okay, read the question and the answer. Lean la pregunta y la respuesta. Yes. So number one, volunteers. Volunteers for number one. Okay, let's see Amber for number one. Okay, if if you now do. You are late, you show a uh, little B. Call the person you report to. Call the person you report to, letter B. Do you have the same, everybody? Hey, everybody, do you have the same? Does everybody have the same? Todos tienen lo mismo? Yes, excellent. So it's letter B. Thank you, Amber. Great job. Yes. Okay, uh, let's see Galileo, number two. Number two, let me see. Letter C, express the subject clearly. Okay, letter C, express the subject clearly. All right, uh, yes. Okay, so what about the others? Does everybody have the same? Do you have the same, everyone? Teacher, if we apagar el video, no será que se me escucha mejor. Sí, okay, everyone, do you have the same information? And now, ahora? Yes. 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 Okay, so do you have the same information as Galileo? Or you have different information? Yes, it's the same. Yes, it's the yes, same. The Excellent. Same. Exactly. So the answer is express the subject clearly. Letter C, letter C, letter C, okay? So let's see number three. Ana Beatriz, I think she wanted to participate. Ana Beatriz, do you want to share number three? All right. Okay, go which ahead. Which is not good, which is not good, etiquettes with talking on the phone. Is as where interrupts the other speaker. So it's letter B. Ana Beatriz, so it's letter B, right? Yes. Yes, yes that's right. Yes. Interrupt the other speaker, okay? Interrupt the other speaker is not a good etiquette when talking on the phone. Thank you, Ana Beatriz. Thank you very much. Number four, who wants to share, who wants to share number four? Number four? Okay, Jocelyn. Jocelyn? Okay, is your side a call while you're eating with coworkers you show? A little C, leave the table and oh, answer the call. Okay, so it's letter C, right? Uh, leave the table and answer the call. Okay, so do you have the same, everybody? Hi, everybody. Do you have the same? Yes. Yes, teacher. Right. It's the same. Letter, 
Yes. Yes, letter C is the answer. Thank you very much. Okay. Second activity. Voy a, voy a encender la cámara a ver si funciona. Si te la apago rápidamente. Okay. Bien. Yes. Okay. Second activity. On the second activity, this is pronunciation. Okay. This is pronunciation. The second activity is pronunciation. The idea is that you listen to an audio about the article, and then you follow the reading. You see in la lectura, you follow the reading. The idea is that you learn the pronunciation of the article, okay? So please. Teacher. Yeah. ¿Cómo pronunciaría eh, guideline? Así it's, está okay. Bien. it's okay, don't worry. We are going there. Ahorita vamos a eso. We are going there. It's okay. Good. So please, listen to the pronunciation of the article and read, listen and read. Escuchemos el audio y sigamos la lectura. Listen to the audio and follow the reading. We will listen twice. Escucharemos dos veces. We will listen twice, okay? So please follow the reading. Por favor, sigan la lectura. Please follow the, the reading, okay? So let's go. Vamos entonces. Voy a apagar la cámara para que tenga mejor audio. To have better audio. Okay. Do you see the article? Miran el artículo, ¿verdad? Do you see the article? Yes or no? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yes. Yes. All right. Now let me share sound. Le voy a compartir. Yeah. Yes, teacher. Good etiquette at the workplace. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you had an emergency, that is okay. However, habitual late commerce are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, no escucha, the etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority no se escucha el audio. the reason why you are late. Etiquette no se... is also important. Hi, everyone. No se escucha el audio? Se corta el audio? Hola a todos, hello. Sí, teacher. Y si, y si deja de compartir y, y, y solamente lo lee usted y lo vamos siguiendo nosotros en el... Oh, ok. No sé lo que tengamos el documento. Yes, mejor, que, mejor hagamos eso entonces. Let's do that. I think it's better. Ok. Yes. Porque hay problemas, hay, hay demasiados problemas de conexión. We have so many connection problems. Ok. Good. Entonces, le voy a leer y ustedes escuchan y siguen la lectura. You listen and follow the, the reading, ¿ok? Are you ready? ¿Estamos okay. listos? Yes. Ok, let's do it. Hagámoslo entonces. Good etiquette at the workplace. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you had an emergency, that is okay. However... Habitual latecomers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority and report the reason why you are late. Etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace email etiquette of other countries. In official emails, you need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal grammatically and grammatically correct language for emails. In addition, knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. 
Be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisors. Listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpretations. Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your coworkers. If you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not talk loudly while eating. And remember, close your mouth when you chew. You should remember that your behavior and manners are under observation. Following etiquette guidelines can play a very vital role for future promotions. Yes. You hear it well. No se escuchó cortado en ninguna parte. No? No. Oh, no. Okay, okay, perfect. I think it's better then. Creo que está mejor entonces. So, I will pronounce it one more time. Lo haré una vez más. Maybe okay. what you can do is that if you have the photocopy of the material, you can underline the vocabulary that is difficult for you to pronounce, okay? Pueden subrayar las palabras okay. que son difíciles de pronunciar. O las pueden resaltar okay. si tienen computadora, okay? Okay, so please listen again. Escuchamos otra vez entonces. Listen again. Okay. Sorry, solo tal vez los demás si apagan el micrófono porque cuando ella nos iba mencionando, eh, no sabía lo que usted decía. Oh, yeah, it's true. So can uh, everyone turn on the microphone, please? Ahorita le voy a desactivar el micrófono a algunos. I'm sorry about that. Okay. Now, let's, we are ready. Please don't turn on the microphone. Por favor, no enciendan el micrófono. Okay? Si van a repetir, que sea para ustedes. It has to be for you. Okay, let's listen again. Escuchemos otra vez entonces. Let's listen again. Just let me drink a little water. Okay, let's start. Empecemos. Good etiquette at the workplace. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you're late because you had an emergency, that is okay. However, habitual late comers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority and report the reason why you are late. Etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with your employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace email etiquette of the other countries. In the official emails, you need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and grammatically correct language for emails. In addition, knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisors. Listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpretations. Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your coworkers. If you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not talk loudly while eating, and remember to close your mouth when you chew. You should remember that your behavior and manners are under observation. Following etiquette guidelines can play a very vital role for the future, for future promotions, okay? So do you have any doubts in pronunciation? ¿Tienen alguna duda? No, teacher. No, it's clear, right? So for uh, guidelines, I think Amber's question was, how do you pronounce guidelines, right? So it's guidelines. Guidelines. Any other doubt in pronunciation? Shoe. Sorry? Shoe or shell. No, sé cómo no se chew. Pronuncia. Say chew. Masticar. It's chew. Chu. Con el estornudo. Chu. <laughs> yeah, like, ha chu. Or you only say chu. <laughs> chu. Uh, Nelson, do you have any doubt? 
I can see you turn on the microphone. No, no doubt. I have a question. What is it? In the penultimate mm -hmm. paragraph, in the second line, where it says on the cell phone, the eh, word during, during, así say, no you say during, cómo. during. As así. it is, así como está, during our daily work. Okay, thank you. Yeah, it's okay. Any other word? Remember, the focus of this, of this activity is pronunciation, okay? The most important in this activity is pronunciation, not comprehension, okay? No es comprensión. The most important is pronunciation, okay? Ember? Uh, the word grammatically. Oh, grammaticalmente. The pronunciation is uh, grammatically. 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 word knowledge 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 rocio knowledge. knowledge conocimiento is knowledge knowledge, knowledge. yeah eh, teacher, tengo bastante problema de inter casi no escucho muy bien pero tengo acá la palabra en la, en la primera línea que dice eric will blindness ¿Cómo se pronuncia let me check eric will eh, en la primera en la primera línea dice diary many workplace etiquette guidelines 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 ah ok outline guidelines guidelines ok gracias ok um, so I, I repeat the idea of this activity is pronunciation so again we will go to break our rooms and this time take you, we will go in pairs, okay? Para esto vamos a ir en parejas. We will go in pairs, okay? So please, take turns. Maybe one person can pronounce one paragraph and the other person can pronounce the other paragraph. Take turns, tomen turnos. Y luego cambian. ¿Cuál es? Can you change Vamos solo a, 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 este, a leer. Yes, only pronunciation. And you help each other. Okay. Se ayudan. okay. Gente, you help each other, okay? So this is only okay. pronunciation. Es solo para pronunciación. This is only for Pronunciation. Okay. Okay. Any okay. question? Okay. Any question? No? No, no. question. No question. No ah, question. Solo quiero hacer una pregunta. Juan Carlos Salas, Dinora, Omar Francisco, ¿van a participar en la actividad? Sorry, teacher. No. No. Okay. Dinora. Alejandro. No, no puedo, teacher. Okay. Yes, Dinora. teacher. Yes. yes. Te pregunto porque la cámara está apagada y quiero asegurarme para hacer las parejas, okay? Yes, yes, Nora, teacher, estoy, pero no puedo. Ok, ok, it's ok, Alejandro. Juan Carlos? All right. I have his participants. 14 participants. So we will make seven, seven pairs. Ok, let's go to pronounce. Vamos a pronunciar. Let's go to. If you are alone, ask for help. Si están solos, piden ayuda. Ask for help, okay? Hello, teacher. Eh, era porque estaba sola, pero ya está Ana conmigo. Okay. 
Okay. Uh, Your, uh, lo, lo oímos cortado, teacher. No, no, I am saying, uh, Beatriz, that uh, I'm sorry for taking you out of the group. Lo siento por sacarla del grupo, Ana Beatriz. Pero Frida necesitaba ayuda. No problem, teacher. Frida needed help, okay? And you no were problem. three. You said okay. seven, three. Okay? Okay, okay, continue. Okay. Your, if you're getting me to set a battery. Okay. Okay. There are a good Erica at the workplace. There are many workplace Erica guidelines, but the most important thing is to point. Yes. You need. You need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and grammatically correct language for emails. In addition, knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisors. Listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to a poor wrong interpretation. Erica, guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your co-workers. If you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not, do not talk loudly while eating. And remember to close your mouth when you chew. You should remember that your behavior and manners are under observation. Following etiquette guidelines can play a very viral, viral role for future promotions. Again? Yes. Now okay. I start. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you had an, an emergency, that is okay. However, a virtual late comers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concern authority and report the reason why you are late. Etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace, emails, etiquette of other countries. In the official image, you need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and gram grammatical correct language for emails. In addition, no, no. Perdón. I'm sorry. Perdón, perdón. No, 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 no. In addition, no relation of cell phone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the cell phone at some point during our daily work. Be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisors. Listen to what they say careful and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak of the workplace email etiquette of the other countries in the official emails you need to mention 
the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should you say formal and grammatically correct language for emails. Um, in addition, I don't know how to say the word. In addition. Well, in addition to the layer of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone and some point during our daily work. Be polite when you turn to your employees or your supervisors. Listen to what they say careful and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid from interpret interpretation. Any case that lie are important even. We are you celebra celebrity with you co-worker. If you get a call when are eighteen, say excuse me, and then receive the call. Do you not sell lonely while why eight eighteen? And remember to close your mouth when you change. You shall remember that your behavior and manner are under observation. Following Erika's guidelines can place a very bitter rule for future prom promotion. Bueno. Lo siento, hay varias palabras que me cuestan. Ajá. A mí también. Sí. Which words are difficult for you? Um, eh, por lo menos, gramática. 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 Gramaticalmente, yes, gramática. Ok. Gramática. Um, también eh, knowledge. 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 Exactly. Knowledge. Knowledge. Quiero uh, ver. También esa otra. Uh, lonely. Lonely. In which line? ¿En, cu en qué línea es esa? Uh, después de donde dice, excuse me. And then receive the call. Ah, loudly. Have... loudly. 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 Ah, loudly. Do not, do not talk loudly. 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 Yes. Okay. Y esa behavior. Which one? Behavior. What? Be ah, behavior. Ah, be behavior. 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 Okay. Sí, creo que estas son las que más me están costando. Ok, perfecto. Thank you, teacher. Ok. So, did you, how many times did you practice? Ok. Mm, ok. How many times did you practice? Ya, yeah, ya, yeah, tú. Ah, you practice, ok. Yes. Ok. How many times? ¿Cuántas veces? How many times? Mm, two. Two. Ok. Yeah, that's, that's enough. Está bien. That's enough.
Teacher. Yeah. I need two minutes. You need to. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> I uh, I think I think I need vitamins. Lately, I forget things. <laughs> so I, I've been forgetting things lately. I think I need some 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 multivitamins. Not only vitamins, multivitamins. <laughs> Okay, I will give you the two minutes. Okay, when, when everybody comes back. Cuando todos regresen, voy a dar los dos minutos. When everybody comes back. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I have forgotten. Okay, uh, okay, everyone. So, Ember here is reminding me about the two minutes, right? I forgot yesterday and I almost, well, I forgot today. But I think you need the two minutes. I'm sure you need the two minutes, okay? So uh, just before I give you the two minutes, I don't know if you have any word that is difficult for you to pronounce or everything is clear. Uh, grammatically. Gramma ah, you say grammatically. Grammatically. Cli. The last sound is cli. Grammatically. All right? Grammatically. It's grammatical method, uh, right? And however. sorry, however, however, you say, however, however, however is like, um, but right, sin embargo, okay, however, sin embargo, however, okay, very good. Any other, no, okay, so, uh, solo le voy a pasar asistencia y luego le doy los dos minutos, okay, I will give the two minutes afterwards, o si no, después cuando me, me cuesta pasarles porque algunos que se tratan un poquito más. Okay, let's see, Alejandro Antonio. In his presence. Present teacher, present teacher. Okay, okay, Ana Abigail. I'm here. Ana Beatriz. Present. Christian. Present. Ember. I'm here. Okay, uh, Frida. I'm here. Uh, Jacqueline Lisette. Jacqueline Lisette. I'm here. Okay, uh, Juan Carlos. Okay, Juan Carlos Salas. Juan Carlos Rivas. Present. Um, María Elena. María Elena, she's not connected. Okay, uh, Mauricio Antonio. Present. Nelson. Nelson. Omar. Present teacher. Uh, Oscar Ernesto. Rocío. Teacher, a Nelson le vamos a cantar a veces. Perdón. Perdón. Ok, a uh, Oscar Ernesto, Rocío Lourdes. Rocío. Se le congeló al teacher. Rocío. Present. Ok, ok, thank you. Jacqueline Gloribel. Present. Uh, Jocelyn Joana. I'm here. Dinora. Present Dinora. teacher. En Galileo. Present. Okay. Okay, okay, Galileo. Thank you very much. Okay, so please uh, take the two minutes. Tomemos los dos minutos. Estamos en dos minutos. In two minutes, okay, in two minutes. Come on, two minutes. Let's take the teacher. I get to the corrato, but I get to the court. The go on a signal. Okay.
Okay, we have seconds. We have seconds to come back. Back. Ten seconds. Second. Back. Okay. I will not. Time is over. Time is. Okay, very good. So let's continue. Let's get it done. No le escucha, teacher. No se escucha. Ahora, en now. Ahora sí. Ahora sí, más o menos. Kind of. Good. So, uh, to continue, I have some questions, okay? So, please, stop checking the article. Stop checking the article about etiquette. Questions for you, for anybody, okay? If you have the answer, just say the answer. Yes? Um, which, okay, the question is, which etiquette guidelines can you tell me from the article? Which article guidelines do you remember from the article? Which, uh, which etiquette guidelines do you remember from the article? Tell me one you remember. Díganme uno que recuerdan. Tell me one you be, remember. Be punctual. Be punctual, exactly. Be punctual. Any other? Before you... the doctor employees. Okay, Galileo and then Juan Carlos. Galileo? If you, if you are late, you must report with your supervisor. You must report to the supervisor. Excellent. Juan Carlos Rivas? Be polite when you talk to your employees or supervisors. Yeah, be polite when you talk to your employees or supervisors. Excellent. Thank you, Juan Carlos Rivas. Any other etiquette you remember? Close your mouth when you chew. Close your mouth when you chew, when you are eating. Okay, very good. Thank you, Amber. Jacqueline Lisette, do you have one? Jacqueline Lisette, do you have can one? You get your hotel pass? Can you repeat it? Can you repeat it, please? But say it louder. Can you repeat, Hola, Jacqueline? ¿me oyen? Yes, repeat it, please. Pero acércase más el, el, el micrófono. Hola. Hola, hola. Te escuchamos. We hola. listen to you. We listen to you, Jacqueline. Hola. Hi, Jacqueline. Okay. Eh... Yes, repeat it. I think she has problems with the internet. Okay, somebody else? Are you must? Somebody else? Which etiquette do you remember from the article? Somebody said be punctual. Mention, mention the, su the subject clearly. Mention the subject clearly. Very good. Thank you very much. Anybody else? Do not talk loudly. Do not talk loudly at work. Loudly. 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 Thank you, Frida. Anybody else? Listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. That's right. Listen to what other people say carefully to avoid uh, possible misunderstandings, right? Para evitar malentendidos, to avoid misunderstandings, yes? Good. Thank you very much. Do we have more? Tenemos más? Do we have more? Or that's it? O eso es todo? That's it. Okay, very good. Now listen, I will try to turn on my camera. Voy a intentar encender mi, mi cámara, tal vez funciona, okay? Okay, listen. Yo tengo problemas de inter, teacher. No, me sale cada rato. Okay, it's okay, do it. Just try to stay connected, okay? Just try to stay connected, Mr. Cabarret. Okay, everybody. Now is your time to work. Now is your time to work. What are you going to do? ¿Qué van a hacer? What are you going to do? To do? Sorry. 
you will okay um listen you will work in pairs or in groups imagine imagine use your imagination imagine you are in charge of a group that is going to visit another company to make an alliance okay you are in charge of this group están a cargo ustedes you are in charge of a group that is going to visit another company to make an alliance what is alliance alianza alianza, alianza. una alianza an alliance very good Write a short etiquette manual for your colleagues, right? Van a hacerles un manual de etiquetas a los compañeros, okay? The ones who are going to, to visit another company, yeah? So your work is to create a little manual with etiquette for your co-workers, okay? And you can use this, um, you can use this uh, form. Podemos usar este, este formulario que es aquí. At least you need to write Six etiquette guidelines, at least, at menos, at least, okay? So you start like this, empezamos así. Etiquette manual year 2021, right? 2021, okay? And then you start with the etiquette. Luego empezamos con las etiquetas. Start with the etiquette, okay? Any question? No? Okay, you can use etiquette, we started in the class, or, or you can use your own etiquette. Pueden usar su propia etiqueta, lo que ustedes aplican en su trabajo. Yes? The idea is to use your imagination. A group of co-workers is going to another company to make an alliance. Write the etiquette for these co-workers. Imagine maybe that your co-workers are going to Colombia, or your co-workers are going to Germany, I don't know, to Spain or Mexico, I don't know, okay? So, and you give them the appropriate etiquette. The appropriate etiquette. And you write it on the form. La van a escribir en este pequeño manual que está ahí. Ese manual o esa está en la página 6. Page 36. Okay? Any question? No? Okay, let's go to work then. In groups of three. Vamos a ir en el equipo de tres. Okay? Let's go to work. Vamos a. Ready? Is this? Another company to make an alliance, write a short etiquette, manual for your colleagues. Okay. Okay. I have a question. In this, in esta parte de acá es la que vamos a trabajar. Yes, that's Eso. right. Yeah, on the etiquette manual year 2021. Okay. On that space, on that space. At least you need to write, uh, at least, right? At least you need to write uh, six, okay? Six etiquette uh, guidelines. Okay, thank you. Okay. Yeah. 
You are in charge of a group that is going to visit another company to make an alliance, right? A short etiquette manual. Uh, Eric calls. Vaya. Eh, puede ser esta, mira. Where. Veamos. Eh, where. Yeah, eh, uniform. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> Mario Bros. <ríe> swing, 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 swing. Sí, es el rinto. Ok. We have, Mario Where, Bros fan here. We have a Mario Bros. fan here. Yeah, Mario Bros. <ríe> He's a fan of Mario Bros. Uh, respectful is with one L, Galileo. Respectful is with one L. Respectful. One L. One L. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, where, where, eh, eh, no, this sería be present, sorry, presentable, no sé, presentable está bien así. Mm, I don't be, think. Or oh, wear a uniform. Maybe you can say, um, yeah, wear the uniform, that's enough. Wear the uniform. The uniform. Well, at okay. work. Maybe you can say wear the uniform um, during the what? At the at the visit. At the, during. Uh, yeah, that's right. Estamos maybe you can say. A... Maybe ¿Sí? you can say during the visit. During the visit. I think it's a better word. During the visit. During yeah. the visit. Yeah, that's better. Okay, Christian. Esta que está aquí, ¿te parece? Stay accountable. Este... Esto es como ser responsable o mantenerse responsable. Puede ser be accountable también, ¿verdad, teacher? No sé. Yes, I think it's better to say be accountable in this case. Be accountable. Be, account... be accountable. Okay. Yeah. Uh, be seriously. No sé, parece repetitivo el B, pero estamos... Yeah, but what do you mean by B seriously? Seriously, yes. I mean, eh, don't kidding in, during the visit. Okay. Eh, I think that's included in be respectful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. In, in my opinion, right? Yeah. yeah. Maybe think, think, I, about an, yeah, think about another one. I agree. Maybe. Mm. Maybe. 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 I need a song. I I need a song who brings me coffee. <laughs> I need a song. Don't give. No, no le quieren dar. Don't. No le quieren dar. ¿Cómo sería, teacher? They don't want to give him. They don't want to give him. Give, ah, give el verbo. To give. En, at, presente. Yes, they don't want to give him. Okay. Okay. To, to give him any coffee. <laughs> I think they want to give him coffee, but he wants more sugar. Yeah. Um. Puede ser otra. Sí, eh, where the, the uniform correctly. 
¿Cómo? Wear the uniform. Correcto. Una camisa adentro. Okay. El otro sería eh, use the use in this case is use no well no wear bear say the sentence because I didn't listen to it use the safety equipment yes um hold on hold on hold on hold on safety equipment like the the safety. helmet exactly uh -huh. like the helmet uh, the, yeah in, you say where the same where because where? it's about yeah where where is the safety equipment where because it's something that you put on your body okay ah okay yes you say where and use the equipment the safety equipment is si es maquinaria Eh, si ya sería use o sea en el caso de, de ocupar alguna maquinaria que sea para what I feel is that, yes I, I understand your point what I feel is that if it's on your body if it's in, on your body you say wear because you are putting something on your body like a, like a shirt, a helmet um, a mask some glasses okay you say wear okay mm -hmm. yeah it doesn't matter if it's for machinery or Whatever, but if it's on your body, you say where. Okay. This is where safety, the safety, the safety equipment. equipment. On the last, we clear. Esa que el aspecto de 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 no andar variando en lo que se va a hablar, ¿verdad? Sino que Ah, pues sí, como sí, ya me, llevaron ya me como... descubrió el teacher. Que, no, hombre, qué barbaridad, no me avisaron. I'm sorry. Y yo con <risa> todo el... Qué barbaridad. You were, you were inspired. You had a, you had a great inspiration. <risa> yeah. Hasta la inspiración se nos fue, teacher. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... To make you lose your inspiration. I didn't mean to do that. No hay problema, teacher. I know. Eso es lo que, no sé, tener una, no sé si será etiqueta, ya tener una, una. Yo me confundo con eso de las etiquetas y las reglas. It's almost. Para mí, vaya. It's almost the same. It's, it's the same. Bueno. Lo único que esta no va porque se entra en la negociación. Es más que todo de vestir y de actuar, ¿verdad? De portarse. ¿Mm? Ajá, pues sí, es que eso es lo que, lo que yo tenía entendido, que las etiquetas son como una forma de cómo actuar, uh -huh. de vestir, de hablar. Yes, the, the, what, what I feel is that etiquette is like a bit softer. Son como más suaves en, 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 en rules, las reglas o normas son más como más directas más fuertes they are stronger mm -hmm. como no hacer esto no yes hacer that, that's right you, 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 you uh, like no comer for example so it's a you know it's a rule es una regla right no comer o mm -hmm. no hacer esto okay so that, that's the difference mm -hmm. okay yeah they are more the, the rules are more direct son más directas no haga esto don't do this okay Okay. okay, teacher. Yeah. Thank you. Ah, okay. Nosotros tenemos tres. Try to okay. not talk about the competition enterprise. Repeat it, please. Always try not to talk about the competition. Como... Okay. Yeah, yeah. I get, I get you. I get you. Okay. Continue with always, the other. Always keep respect. Siempre always. mantener el respeto. Mm -hmm. Always keep respect. Respect. Y... Maybe, maybe say it directly, okay? Um, maybe you can say be respectful 
or maybe you can say always respect others. Always respect always others. Respect others. Mm -hmm. okay. others. So, es el final. Yes, because it's plural. Entonces quitaríamos el keep o el keep. Yeah, the thing is that keep respect is not like very common in English. I mean, in Spanish, in Spanish it makes sense, others. but in English it's not so common, okay? So you can say, you can say either be respectful or um, respect others, okay? Always respect okay. others. Respect others, okay. Okay, so they hear you always respect others. Okay, no problem, it's okay. Y la última? Wear formal dress. No decir palabras o veces. Ah, o usar el... el, el hablar hablar adecuadamente. Ajá, ajá. ¿Cómo sí, sería? sería una. Ahí tengo el traductor. ¿Cómo sería? To speak appropriately. Hablar. To, to speak, speak appro appropriately. ¿Cuándo usamos speak y cuándo usamos talk? Sorry? ¿Cuándo usamos speak y cuándo usamos talk? Good question. Talk is mostly like platicar, ¿ok? okay. And speak is hablar. So, I mean, you use speak mainly for languages or like speak mm -hmm. directly to someone, like speak to your boss, for example. I spoke to my with my boss. Yeah. And okay. talk is like when you have a, like, you, you talk like, the, there is like a conversation, okay? And in oh, a, okay. Yeah, when you speak, there is like a, a long conversation. Yeah. Okay. Eh, otra podría ser no, no hablar eh, de, de temas personales, pienso, no sé. O evitar. Avoid, Just, you can say avoid, avoid personal problems at work. Evita, evita hablar, avoid uh, talking about personal problems, okay? Avoid mm -hmm. talking uh -huh, about personal problems. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay, no problem. Muy amable, ay disculpe que estuve media hora afuera, pero... Uh, uh, no I, didn't, I didn't know, I didn't know, but now that you said it... <laughs> ok, thank you. Ok. Microphone. Who has, sorry, who has the one on one session today? Who has the one on one session today? Oh, it's Ana Beatriz. Okay, today we have Ana Beatriz for the one on one session. Okay, Ana Beatriz. All right, so please don't forget to say. Yes. Okay, uh, okay, just before we go, uh, did everybody finish uh, the manual? The etiquette guidance for you for the manual? Everyone finished? Okay, so uh, yes. to, tomorrow at the beginning of the class, you will get together with other classmates, not the classmates of your group, okay? You will get together with other classmates and you will compare, okay? Okay, you will, you will compare your guidelines or your etiquette guidelines with others uh, etiquettes or with others classmates etiquette guidelines, okay? So, but tomorrow, today we don't have more time for, for doing this, okay? But please have it uh, at hand. Tengan mano mañana. Have it at hand mañana, I mean the etiquette, okay? Good, so let me pass the attendance quickly. Oh, just before I forget, antes de que se me olvide, eh, también no olviden completar los ejercicios. Mañana antes de, de, de terminar la sesión, Los ejercicios de la semana 3 deben estar completos en la plataforma, ¿ok? No, 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 por favor, no permitan de que les esté diciendo el viernes ya bien noche o el sábado en la mañana. Por eso les estoy recordando ahorita, ¿ok? Porque a veces pasa eso, de que les tengo que estar diciendo el sábado en la mañana que completen todavía. 
Por eso se, siempre se viene diciendo con tiempo, ¿ok? Así que tratemos de completar la plataforma para que mañana después de la clase yo pueda eh, sencillamente ir y subir, la, subir las notas, ¿ok? Digo eso porque la vez pasada me quedé como 30 minutos más esperando que algunos completaran, que no habían completado, ¿ok? Así que por favor, háganlo hoy y durante, mañana durante el día para que cuando vengamos a la clase mañana ya esté completa la semana, ¿ok? Ok. Ok, so let me pass the attendance quickly. Alejandro Antonio. Present teacher. Ana Abigail. Yeah. Ana Beatriz. Present. Cristian. Present. Ember. Present. Frida. Present. Jacqueline. Lisette. No, no se logró con oh, Ok, sí, sí. Ok. Uh, Juan Carlos Salas. He was connected. But... Juan Carlos Rivas. Ok. Um, María Elena. She couldn't get connected today, right? No se conectó a María Elena. Mauricio Antonio. Present. Nelson Gabarrete. Aguirre, teacher. Omar Francisco. Present, teacher. Oscar Arnulfo. Oscar Arnulfo. Present, present. Ok, ok. Rocío. Um, Jacqueline Gloribel. Gloribel. Present. Ah, uh, Jocelyn Joana. Present. Ok, ok, Gloribel. Jocelyn Joana. Yesenia Nora. I'm here. Ok, ok. <laughs> Dinora. I'm here, teacher. Yeah, it's ok. I put the attendance. Don't worry. Uh, Dinora. And finally, um, Galileo. Present teacher. Ok, very good. Thank you very much. Ah, no se les olvide siempre el correo que hicieron ayer deben ir a postearlo a la, al foro de discusión. Ok, el foro de discusión se llama uh, a formal email, I think, I don't know, I don't remember, but please, go to forums, vayan a discusión, go to discussion a la plataforma y ahí solo van a vaciar el correo. Ok, ahí les dan algunas indicaciones de lo que van a hacer. Ok, so please do it, por favor lo hacen. Ok, so I see what you have para ver lo que tienen, to see what you have. Okay, thank you very much for connecting. I don't know if you have any question about the class. No? No questions? No question. Okay. No okay, thank you for connecting. See you tomorrow. Take care. Good night and sweet dreams, okay? Bye-bye. Only Ana Beatriz stays. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Okay. Bye. Okay, Beatriz, this space is for you. Uh, I don't know if you have any questions about anything, about English. Yes, um, está viendo picture. Okay. Quiero ver. In Unit 2, en la página 5, de Socialism. Nelson, please, you need to leave the session. Okay, ya se salió Nelson. Okay, sorry, sorry, uh, Ana Beatriz. You, you were saying, me decía. En la página 5 de la unidad 2. Okay, let me go. Unidad 2, uh, unit okay. number 2. Social ¿Qué página del manual directamente? Eh, ah, 24. Okay, let me go. Let me look for it. Yes. The simple past, right? Yes. Yes, yes, tell me. Ay, y siempre tiene que ser en, en la pregunta, teacher, siempre tiene que ser do you o the I. No, no, no. Siempre I mean, tiene que ser al inicio do. Exactly, de cualquier pronombre. Okay, of any pronoun, okay? Déjame compartirte pizarra. Let me share a uh, board. Okay. Porque estoy buscando la pizarra. Yes, basically, uh, you, have, you have to use did. Siempre se usa did al principio de la, de la pregunta, cuando estamos haciendo una pregunta, ¿ok? Uh, you say like, cuando es una pregunta cerrada, when it's a closed question, ¿ok? Pero cuando es una pregunta sí. abierta, it's different, right? Solo le ponemos el what or um, I don't know at the beginning. For example, did, ¿ok? Yeah, solo déjame usar otro color que ese rojo se mira bien raro. Sí. Let me see. 
use another color. <laughs> okay. Um, did, okay. For example, did, uh, did you uh, listen? Did you listen to the instructions, for example? Did you listen to the uh, instructions? So basically, básicamente estamos usando el did, okay? El did se usa para todos los pronombres, para cualquier sujeto, for any subject. El sujeto no importa, siempre vamos a usar did. Puedo decir did she, for example. No como el present que decimos uh -huh. does. No, here we use did for all the subjects. Usamos el did para todos los sujetos, ok? okay? Y um, cuando me dice que había que agregarle was, ¿Perdón? una pregunta abierta, cuando es una pregunta abierta. Ah, uh, for example, imagine you use where, imagínate que usamos where. Sigo la misma estructura, solo digo where did you, ok, where did you listen, el mismo ejemplo, voy a hacer el mismo. Where did you listen uh, to to the instructions, okay? Where did you listen to the instructions? Solo le pongo el, la palabra que hace la pregunta abierta. Puede ser el where, el what, el when, okay? El who, cualquiera de esas, okay? Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay. Y en cuanto a los verbos irregulares, teacher, y los verbos regulares, uh -huh. quiero ver cuál era la... Porque los que son... Por ejemplo, los regulares se de, ¿verdad? Yes. Terminan edeva. Ajá, ajá, jugamos, usamos algunas reglas para ponerle ed. Uh -huh. Ok, por ejemplo, y en los irregulares siempre tiene que ser ing. No, 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 no. I think no. we are, but estamos, ah, hablando del estamos hablando del pasado, ¿verdad? Exacto. Ok, good. No, the irregular verbs, en el caso de los irregulares, no les ponemos ed. Se llaman irregulares, ¿ok? Porque cambian sus formas. For example, por ejemplo, el verbo um, speak. En presente yo digo speak, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Pero en pasado su forma cambia. En pasado sería spoke. Uh -huh. Yes, así como el verbo, por ejemplo, satisfacer en español. Ok, uh -huh. que el verbo satisfacer es un verbo irregular en español porque cambia su forma cuando lo conjugamos. Ok, así ah, es, okay. El, así son estos verbos irregulares en inglés: cambian su forma en presente, en pasado y cualquier otra forma. Y la otra forma que es el pasado participio. Ok, ah, ah, tenemos, okay. tenemos otro, por ejemplo, break, que es como quebrar. Break is in present, este está en presente, pero en pasado sería broke. Ok, broke. Ah, ok. Ajá. Ah, sí. Y para lo, la, la, y para las reglas de los regulares, por ejemplo, si termina con Y y hay una consonante antes para hacerlo en pasado, le vamos a quitar la Y y le vamos a poner IED, study. ¿Ok? Ok. Ah, bien. Ok, Ok. Ok. So, just that, or do you have any other question? No. No, solo es. No. Only that. Yes, solo es. Ok, mm -hmm. thank you very much for connecting, Ana Beatriz. Bueno, gracias, Echeverría. Ok, Feliz thank much. you, good night, and see you tomorrow. Good night. Ok, bye. Bye. bye.